Good morning dads and diecasts. Today we're going to go over a couple cars that I recently picked up that unfortunately I was out and about and didn't have the GoPro with me and have no content of me finding these cars but I did buy them anyway and I basically bought them for you guys. So today we're going to make a video going over some of these cars I picked up and some future customs basically. So today I'm going to go over probably five or six cars that I have future plans to make customs and leave for you guys. And I also want you guys to comment down below if there's any cars you guys would like me to make custom. Either colors, wheel swaps, anything in particular that you guys would like me to make for you guys to leave. Also, if you're new to the channel, this is a diecast channel basically where we do like Hot Wheel and uh, um, Auto World and Matchbox peg hunting basically and look for cars and stuff and I also make a lot of customs out of the cars and leave them in the stores for you guys to find. So I'm basically letting y'all know this to um, who's new to my channel, who's just tuning in, who's just subscribing. I'm basically letting you know this is what we do here. So today, well yesterday, I found a treasure hunt for y'all. One I don't see on the shelves too much. It came from MK's I believe. And I want to make a custom out of it for y'all. I know most of y'all probably have this car. It's not a super treasure hunt. It's a regular treasure hunt. But this is definitely on my list to make a custom for you guys. If any of y'all would really appreciate finding a custom treasure hunt, let me know. Because y'all feedback is what inspires me to keep doing what I do and keep pushing forward. So this is definitely going to be done for you guys. Another custom I'm thinking about doing for you guys that I actually did for myself has a test. Basically, like you would call it um, my pre-production shot at it. Y'all like the Datsun 510? What if I make y'all a drag version of this? Which I'll show y'all my version now so y'all can see what I'm talking about. This would be the drag version of the 510. It has a willy bar, custom willy bar. It's got a custom drag wing. It's been full detailed, fully painted, wheel swapped, and it's got a dump pipe for the exhaust, for the turbo and stuff. This is one of my custom 510s, guys. I get bored and I make a lot of customs for you guys. For instance, here's another custom. This wagon. It's like a burnt orange. This is my spin on the little uh, dots in the 620. I don't know if this color is going to pick up on camera for you guys or these wheels, but that's another one of my customs. So like I'm saying, I have a lot of customs ideas and all type of stuff I can make for you guys. My problem is y'all ain't giving me no feedback on what y'all want. So I kind of want to please you guys. I don't want to just do stuff for the fun of it because I like to do it, which I do. But I also want to do what I'm doing to make y'all happy. I even have a premium this is going to be the first premium I'm going to attempt to make a custom out of and leave for you guys in the store. I have never done an actual premium, but we're going to try one. And we're going to make a drag car out of this super for y'all. So. Oh, I want to show y'all something else too. I actually have a line of dunks. If those of you who are not familiar with what a dunk is, you know, like the old school cars that have like the really big rims and stuff on them. Yeah, well, those are like kind of considered dunks. It's more to it depending on the year of the car and blah, 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 blah. But I have my own little lineup I'm making now of dunks. This is one of the Christmas editions that just came out in stores. Check this out. Look what I did with the Matchbox.
This was a matchbox. And I also want to show y'all my son, my oldest son, Daniel, his first custom. This is the first custom he ever made, which I did help him with. But we'll swap custom cyber truck. And like I said, if you guys are interested in my customs, you don't have to like go beat up the stores to find my customs and hope it's what you want. You can comment down below and I will DM you on Facebook or Instagram and you can directly message me and tell me what you want. And I do sell customs, guys. So I'll leave that as that. And I sell them for a very good price. So if you're interested, let me know. Also, I'm going to add the clips to this of the custom white and gold Atroka I made. Um, I'm going to make another version of that. Stay tuned for of the black version. It's going to have black and gold real rider tires, the gold low rider bike, all the same stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and drop that in this video as well for you guys now. Good morning. Welcome back to another Dads and Diecast episode. Today is Friday. Today we're just going to build a little cool custom for y'all. And I'm kind of going to walk y'all through this process. So, for this custom, we're going to use these three vehicles. We have a premium, which I already did drill apart. And it's from the Hot Wheel Boulevard set which is going to be the Super B. We're going to use this premium. We have this 1998 Pop Cycle. We're going to use this. And we found the white and gold Latroka, which is going to be the main base of this build. I do want to build another one of these that's going to be similar, guys, of the black and gold Latroka, which we will find. But in the meantime, we're going to go ahead and start this. So first things first, we need to take this up the blister. Nice way. Don't matter about this guy. We're going to take him out. And we need to take the wheels off this. So I'll see y'all after that's done. So, we completely disassembled the Super B. Because I really wanted these wheels from her. And, using the acetone trick. We very nicely took the little choke out the package. Now we're gonna let this dry. And we have her in all her glory here. Doesn't look too gold on camera. Oh, yes, it does. But y'all gonna like this build. The third car that I opened up, I do have it all apart in all the pieces. I took a certain piece out of it, which is gonna be a surprise that I'm gonna leave in the video. So stay tuned. I didn't wanna show y'all yet. So we're going to go ahead and drill this apart and paint these. We're going to try painting the tires and wheels, guys, something different. And we're going to paint some stuff that we're going to attach. So I'll see y'all shortly. So we just got done spray painting the tires white. I've never actually spray painted the outside of tires white guys but I can't find no white tires nowhere so that's what we're doing so now I'm gonna go ahead and paint the rims and the special part of this build gold see y'all shortly and as y'all can see the rims are still silver never mind my nails I've been building and sanding stuff earlier this morning but I'm going to go ahead and paint these gold for y'all. So now my gold rims are drying. I can show y'all the last item we used from the pop cycle truck. Yes, guys. I got the little mini low rider bike that was chrome that I painted gold from the pop cycle truck. So, y'all can only imagine where we're going with this build. Stay tuned. Just like that, guys. That's my take on a little trooper truck. We're definitely going to do the black and gold one next. Hope y'all like it. I do sell customs and make 
cars or prom requests if anyone is interested in any of my customs just comment down below and i'll send you a link where you can message me through ig or something and we can get in contact thanks so hope y'all enjoyed this short little video of just showing you all some of my customs and some of my work and i also want some of your feedback that was my main reason of making this video i'd greatly appreciate if you guys let me know on any type of future customs you guys would like to see or anything to that nature <clears throat> all my new subscribers and new support i thank y'all so much like you guys are awesome to my fellow subscribers that have been already subscribed and watching my videos you guys are above and beyond amazing i really appreciate all y'all dads and diecast we out y'all have a good friday morning